Now we do have one rule that's going to start from the very beginning, just because I uh, didn't end up using it last stream, so I really got to catch up with that. <coughs> Otherwise, we're a fresh new game. We're not playing the game backwards, we're not not looking at the water wraith anymore, we're not uh, playing with our feet, so if you want a rule, you gotta pitch it in yourself. Let's begin. Oh man, we got 10 days in already. Nice. Right -o. Uh, don't actually remember entirely what we did last time, but let me start on something simple, I think. Oh well, are there even any simple games left? I didn't get everything in the Bulbalex Kingdom, okay. We're gonna go for the Snagrit Hole, I think. I wanna, I wanna start nice and simple. We'll go into the ch extra crazy challenging later. The one where I clap, oh yeah. They're all gone. We're refreshing the rules. The one rule we have at the moment is uh, Matt's rule from last stream. If you were there, we can also, if you're actually on the stream, you can probably see it on the chat, or maybe that's just me. He put in 200 bits for us to do a special rule, which is we take out 50 Pikmin at the beginning of every game, that being 10 Pikmin per type. Every time we gain a treasure, we... Oh, shoot, I don't actually remember it. Uh, every time we gain a treasure, we gain a Pikmin, and let me check on my laptop so I can see. Every time... Okay, so every time we guess a treasure or enemy, treasure or enemy right, we get a Pikmin. Every time we get it wrong, we lose a Pikmin. So we have got another sacrificing rule. Isn't that fun for everyone? I'm doing this the wrong way around. Now, actually, even though we don't have ten of the purples and whites, I think I'm going to keep it. So then I've got a little extra challenge in that I don't have a lot of Pikmin. Although I just realised we're going to be going into the cave with this many Pikmin, so. Oh my god, we got three blues? Alright, I'm gonna do my best then to raise up some numbers. Sounds like a good plan to me. Where's that other blue? We got one blue in here, no? We have three blues. Alright, fine. Whatever, man. Oh, that's where the blue went. I'm glad that the purples and whites know where to go. Okay. Um, hopefully I can hear also the sound effect. I've, I think I, it should all be set up right. weren't here last stream, then you can probably tell that last stream was a bit of a disaster by how we've only got three blues. We went to the submerged castle at the end, and they were the only ones that remained. Eesh. Once again, you get to name the sacrifices. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about that. Well, that'll be fun to see uh, later on. Does everyone remember the names? You're gonna have to look back in the old stream to see what people messaged. What do I, who do I remember? I remember there was Bolt. Uh, that's actually, I think that's the only one I remember, honestly. <laughs> Oops. Okay, Z is that button. Ah, there we go, that button. What does that do? Nothing. Oh, that's the, that's the swarm button. I should have known that already. That was a bit weird physics, but alright. Oh, all our, all our, of course, all our blues are leaves. That's why they're not moving very fast. Mm -hmm -hmm. What do I want? I definitely want potions. Actually, more than anything, this live, sh this stream needs potions or this playthrough. So here. Oh, shoot, I forgot we got the pluckophone. When did we have that? Who gives us the pluckophone? Never used it. Oops. Oh, I'm gonna want the burp one as well now, actually. Sorry, don't mind me. This is gonna be the this is the this is the calm before the storm, that's what this is. We're just getting our way through the game nice and quickly, nice and not even nice and quickly, just nice and easily. Enjoying the remnants of Pikmin 2 before everything all hell breaks loose in a couple hours. Come on, people. You're better than this. 
Good enough. You have them on a note. Sweet. I assume that is referring to the, uh, the, 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 our lost Pikmin of the past. Orgmore, how you doing? Still doing something. This is just snagrich, snagrich training. That's what this is. This isn't me wasting your valuable time on potions. Snagrit training, I tell you. Even though I'm not actually aiming for the head at all, but hey. Leave Olimar here to do his bidding over here. Man, we not have bitter spray this whole time? Okay. This is going to change our life. What's the button for it? I don't... I didn't know the button for it. Uh, items? I guess I'll find out. It's probably up. Yeah. No. It's one. I see it now. Cool. Noted. Come along, no kitties. Bit weird that they'd split up whenever you whistle them from a distance, but hey, that's Pikmin 2 AI, I guess. No need to explain it. Uh, that is a... Uh, how much are you? Seven? Eight. Damn it, okay. Sorry, that wasn't me trying to guess its name, that was me trying to guess its weight. Being like, that is a seven enemy challenge. Do excuse me. Oh, just in time. And it didn't even hit it. Alright, great. It's much harder to mash the A button on the Wii remote, you know. Thank you very much. This is weird. I'm not used to seeing that. Is it because it's we don't have a purple on it or something? Was that why? That was strange. Usually these fights go a lot more quick. Almost got it as well. Damn. I think we've uh, raised some numbers enough. Um, 
Yeah. So at this point, what have we got for reds? So we got 17. Let's make that just 10. Yellows, just 10. Thank you very much. And blues, just three. Actually, I think I'm going to double those numbers. Just because uh, I'd like to have a group of... I'd like to have a group of 100 instead of a group of 50. I don't want to die. Where's my, where's my remote? There we go. Nope. Come on. There you go, remote. Isn't it nice? Isn't it nice how calm this stream is right now? Doesn't it feel like nothing could go wrong? Doesn't it feel like we don't have horrible screaming death awaiting us? It's a nice time, I must admit. My numbers are wrong. Oh, it's because of the purple and whites. Hello, Vincent. Thanks for joining us. I just want to ask you, what is your favourite Pikmin 2 boss? Oh, uh, what are they? Probably, well, I don't know, man. They're pretty good for different reasons. Like, I love the atmosphere with the water wraith. Like, that's just unrivaled. Uh, I really like the segmented Crobster, just because he's super fun and crazy. Uh, I don't like this Wii Remote boss, because I can't seem to fight him and win for the life of me. Alright, I'm going to go for one final potion thing, because they're here, alright? Give me this. Thank you. Uh, what other ones are there? Uh, I quite liked pretty much all the ones from, um... From the first area, I like. Like, the, the, uh... Empress Bulblex is pretty cool. Just the, the, ad, the added pregnancy aspect and all the kids. I like that. Um, yeah, not like I wouldn't, I, w I definitely wouldn't give a cow slug my favorite. Breadbug's funny, so he's fun to fight just because of how his, his gameplay works. So like, yeah, like one of those. Depends what I'm, what I'm in the mood for, you know? If I want atmosphere, it's water wraith. If anything else, it, it just changes, you know? Right, so it looks like the numbers aren't going to be exactly 20. We've got a, we've got more than in a couple places than usual. But hey, is this going to give us a round 75? No, no, it's not. It's going to give us a slightly off 76. Okay. It's weird having the plucker phone, but not like the whistle extension. It's a weird combo. Um, am I going to cheat for this cave? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I'm not, because I can't physically get up there. Can I cheat so it's just the whites? Yes, I can. Because we ain't got a lot of time and I don't want to spend it struggling on a bridge. Only got nine, but that's fine. Now it's starting to feel like a challenge. I guess it's because it feels like I'm doing something suddenly. Oh, are you kidding me? Alright. Uh, what do you think the odds are Olima can whistle them? This could be a recipe for a da disaster. Whistle accuracy? Yes! Success! Ain't I just a little abnormal? But it worked out fine, so there's no problems here. Do I be greedy and go for more? one might take a little longer. We'll see. Well, no, I just need to get it a little bit long for the poison. <sighs> double three is not 13. I know, I was going for double 10. We had, Olima had seven, so I got three to make it 10. Then I added another 10 to make it 20. I know, I know what I'm doing. All right, I just didn't word it right. Oh, no problem here. Is that a bad reference? 
Maybe not. What do I know? Okay. It's great and all that you got the bridge fixed, but fix this first. Oh, shoot. This might not go in our favor. You better build this quick, boys. Okay, good. Nope. All right, I guess we'll do this tomorrow. What are our numbers so I remember? 23, 20, 22, 92. Okay. Damn it. That could have been good. We, we almost got it. Just didn't know. If this bridge wasn't wasn't broken again, we would have been fine. That's a shame. What happens if a Pikmin is poisoned and then starts to drown? They probably just go. Sh they probably stop poison being poisoned and start drowning. I apologize for not being as efficient as I used to be in life. But I'm actually going to use this opportunity to check some things. See if my new promotion thing works. What I did is instead of uploading a video to YouTube, is I had a private one and made it public. But it might not show up on people's sub boxes. What do I know? Thought I'd try it. Still in my early stages of everything, so I'm testing. Let's find out. <laughs> We're just doing some nice little uh, sprouting while we uh, while we prepare for the stream. That's what this day was. It's all fine. Okay. Looks like it does pop up for people. No. Wait. No. Those are roll comments. Hold on. What about over here? What is happening over on this one? I thought I could be smart and not have to keep uploading the same Hey, we're live now video again and again. Instead, just make it public again. It looks like that doesn't work. That's a shame. So in that case, I need to quickly um, delete these videos and then upload them while we're streaming. How professional. Sorry, it's what I had to do to set these things up. Won't take me a moment, though. We can just chat while we do it. Um, let me just delete this on my laptop. Then I can see the chat again. And we do what we want. Ah, 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 there you are. Action delete. Sorry, buddy. Okay. What's going on over there? I'm uh, gonna have to keep us slightly paused on the map while I do this on my computer, but don't worry, I can see you, everything that's going on. 292 deaths. The game does the job for you. It sure does. It just, it's your way of checking that you got your numbers right. Gosh. I didn't even think of that. We are almost at 300 deaths. That's horrifying. Yeah. These are... Uh, what am I trying to say? These, are, these videos don't take me half a second to upload, thankfully. Da, 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 da. Videos. Live streams. Live now. There you are. And... Da, da, da. And... Uh, well, let me get rid of the tags. Don't need all that. Them all. There we go. Problem solved. No, it didn't do it. Okay. There you go. And save. Processing done. Right, that one's that one. People are going to think I'm half an hour late, but really, they just missed the uh, the harvesting day. How, how dare they? Daz, will you do some theories about the Yumi Bozo and Pikmin 4? Maybe. Maybe he. Sh it depends if he shows up. Yumi Bozo was a Pikmin 2 theory, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. It was a Pikmin 3 theory. Um, yeah. I imagine it's quite obvious. But they very much made it... Like, it's not really a theory at this point. It just is the cultural reference. Considering it was literally called the Yumi Bozo in one of the, one of the versions of the game. But what do I know? It seems more like a Gaijin Goomba kind of episode rather than a game theory kind of episode. See what I mean? If that's the best way to make the analogy. Right, the videos are public now. So that'll be fun. So that means most people just missed the boring bit. If you call it boring, it's the calm bit. So maybe it's not that bad. We're going back in for the Snagrit hole this time. I remember my numbers. 23, 20, 22, 
9 and 7 or something like that. Uh, hold on, I was sending a thing. There we go. Don't mind me, right. Oh, it was 9 and 2, not 9 and 7. Yeah, cool. Ba, 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 da, ba, 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 ba. 23 from you. Basically the same Pikmin. If anything, they might be uh, slightly um, more flowered than the original cast, but that's fine. Lovely. Come along, Louie. We're on for an adventure. Uh... Alright. Oh, shoot. They're going for the bridge. Okay, then we better hurry. Go the long way and all that. Na, na. We've already lost one. Who? Why'd you do this to me? Can't even tell where. Oh well, it's their problem. Now we're at a nice round 75. What was it? It was a blue. Okay. <laughs> Missable, I guess. After all that effort to raise them up and they just, they just disappear on us. Right, controller, can you work please? Shear grubs. Female and male shear grubs are not allowed here. How long has Daz been streaming? Half an hour. If that the exact number, uh, if I can find it on my screen, is 24 minutes. So you missed one day where we harvested some Pikmin. I tried to go for the uh, Snagrit hole while I was here, but we ran out of time last minute because everyone keeps destroying the bridges. Dudes. You serious? Alright, well, thankfully it was a white. Wow, and also physics throwing them under the bridge, huh? Holy crap, this game is a bit funky sometimes, isn't it? <sighs> okay, well, two deaths on the way to the Snagrit Hall. Never thought I'd have to face it, but there it is. Please tuck in. Why are you not- oh, I guess because it's not a finished bridge. Pikmin 1 physics. Ba, ba, ba. Actually, do we need you? No, we don't. Alright, let's lose another three because I just wanted the hole. Oh, and it poisoned- it got poisoned in stream. Or in cutscene, even. I'm sorry, I'm suddenly bad at this game. Alama, run for that last Pikmin. Oh, but there's such big plants here. Oh, the temptation. Right, where's your missing buddy? It's a blue, of course it's a blue. You could do it. Burr, burr. Such nice music, it don't sound like anyone is going to kill us. Is it just one Snagger here? I can't remember because there was two or three in like Pikmin 1. I guess they just downgraded a bit. There you are. Come on everybody. Okay, with a pack of 70, close enough. Let's hop on in. I think mean, they fixed that. They didn't for the Pikmin 1 remake. Oh. The, uh, I imagine that's the uh, the bridge. Oh no, the crushing glitch. They didn't fix it in the Pikmin 1 remake. Alright, kids. If there's ever a time to throw in your rules, now is the time to go for it. Now we're in a cave is when the game really starts. Once again, just pay with some bits. They're the easiest way to do it. If you put in 100 bits or more, then it will be a permanent rule for the rest of the stream. Nice and easily done. It'll have an impact for like 8 hours. Or you can pay less than that, and then um, 
You get a nice little rule for the moment. Might be good for like floor by floor basis. A, a non-permanent, oh well, it might depend on like how many bits you put in. If you put in one, maybe we won't make it half an hour. We'll, we'll see. But generally, um, by the way, male shear grubs. These are all male shear grubs. And that's an orange bauble. Going by the other rule we had earlier. Um, what was I going, what was I trying to say? Um, mm, oh yeah, like, no, I don't even really actually remember it at all. So, whatever. Throw in your rules now. Half an hour is how long a, a non a temporary rule lasts, so I guess you could do it on a floor by floor basis. If you remember the floor and it's like, oh that'll be really challenging if you can't press the A button and make it a so. Um I was gonna say that wouldn't work, but it possibly could, because you'd have to be a swarm only game. That'll be interesting. Oh well, we'll see. Nintendo makes a new Pikmin game, how would amiibos work? It would probably still be the same if you get extra Pikmin. Crystallized telekinesis. I did not guess that, so I guess we'll sacrifice a Pikmin because I didn't think of it. Uh, the other one is a feather. It's the. It's a wing. It's an angel's wing. Angel delight. That's a cake. Um, I don't know what it's called. A light. A polished. Beauty. Pure. Innocence. One of those words, and I get it. If not, sacrifices it is. I did say feather. I'm gonna get mis give myself that one because I'm being cheap on myself. All right. I semi knew that. Just didn't think Leviathan. It's interesting how I don't know how quickly you forget things when you try. Now we're gonna we're gonna sacrifice a low value Pikmin because we don't have any high ones and we don't have many. We already lost a blue. We lost some whites. All that's logically next is the reds, because we had more reds than yellows. Excuse me. Shearwig, get out of here. Hey, Baronet. Come for us. Lovely. I did not sacrifice one. Do we have a lower... Yes, we do. Sweet, there you go. Shearwig, you're welcome. It's a gift. Goodbye, Abra. Apparently that's its name. Male Shear Grub. I don't need to say it every time. -da -da. I've also noticed actually this playthrough, I haven't been too focused on getting my controller to work and also collecting enemies. I don't know why. I've always, always had trouble with the controller that's not helping me. Thank you very much. Oh, I've just... I've always collected the enemies, it just felt right because it's another collectible you could get, so why not get all the collectibles, but this series I've just been, I guess, so focused on the other rules that I just never, it never happened. Do we really need whites? I mean, they're high value, so, uh... And they said there's no fire in here. Thank you. You are nutrient, nutrition, uh, delicacy, crimson. You are big. I feel like it was like a treant word. And I'm also thinking solo. I don't know why, like solo nutrient, even though I don't think that's a name. I don't know what I'm thinking of, but uh, it's what I'm thinking of. Ooh, hello. I'm going to do that trick this time, I think. Because we're so sparse. We really need them. Does it work? Yes, it does! Nice! And actually, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. I thought it'd be quite a tricky thing to do, or like too finicky, but that's not bad at all. So yeah, solo nutrient is my, my guess at the moment. And I'm running with it. What is my controller doing? There we go. Okay. It is positioned slightly differently than last time. Oh, hello. Thanks for the notification. Ed1245, thank you for following us. I did not say combustion or berry. So I guess that's another sacrifice adding to the list. We'll name this one, uh, 
We'll name it Ed because I'm killing my followers now. No, but it, it all works in in that sense. And I guess it will be a blue we sacrifice because we're in a blue only region. Let's go. 21's about to become 20. We were overgrown anyway. All right, lovely. Oh, looks like they're gonna do it for us. No? Okay. You're welcome. Oh, what gets him first? The Shearwig or the... Ed surviving! Look at him go! Oh, can he beat the Shearwig? He beat the Shearwig! Holy cow, look at Ed go! Ah, uh, the Shearwig got him eventually. He got knocked down, but he got up again. Not gonna let anything get him down. Right, this is not a combustion berry. It's a delicacy. A nutrient. <laughs> I'm thinking nutrient again. Uh, sandwich, wrap, center, core. Good lord, I don't know. That's all I can think of, I'm afraid. Uh, what is that way again? Was it just an egg? It was just an egg. Cool, no thank you. Not quite sure why Louis just on his own over here, but apparently he is. I mean, sure, you can do that if you really want to. Come on, core. Taste sensation? No, I did not get that one. And I f very faintly remember it, but not that much. Like, milk tub. I'm ready for the milk tub when that shows up. It's in the final cave, with the Louis cave, but I'm ready for it, you know? Right, now we don't need another Shearwig taking another victim. We want it to be between one of these two. There we go. Now the challenge is who? Which one? I'm not gonna aiming this one. It's all up to you. Can you do it? It's trying. Little Miss No Name. I don't know her name yet, but... She's really going for it. We need dramatic music, but I'm afraid I don't really have it. Though she's also not doing any damage. Uh-oh, the Shearwig's coming back though. With a vengeance. Ah, oh, the Shearwig. Takes it from both of them. And that's the end of the match, people. I never knew her name, but perhaps one of you will enlighten us. Otherwise, that's all our treasure, so uh, let's get out of here. Okay. First things first, swooping snitch bug fun. But it also sounds like feels like something's gonna drop on us. I don't remember. Oh, this is probably yeah, just Snagret region, of course. I remembered where we were. It took me a, a moment, but yes, this is where we are. And there's two here, I think. If I remember right. Guess we'll find out. Yellows it is, please. I might actually play this safe and only attack when it's like that. Perfect. So apparently you're supposed to swarm. I never do.
Dudes, idiots, get out of here. I always like attacking it side on as well. It's just easy to aim. Beautiful. But there's more. We have 64. Come on, buddy. Where are you? There you are. Nope. Didn't swarm. Beautiful. You are hot dog, dog, sausage, meat, meat stick. Your meat stick. I remember you. Good, good. I actually remembered one for one. Ain't that a miracle? Be very quiet. We're all hunting. Oh, meat satchel. Excuse me. We got it right anyway. Got meat. We're all hunting snagwit. Surprised never heard that before. Give me egg, please. Thank you very much. Don't know what's beyond this, but uh, oh, another egg, cool. All right, looks like we're going for this one anyway. Yeah, rude. I guess it's just time to boost up our 64. It's weird having a big group. I'm so used to just having so minimal. Last stream still having an impact on me, even if it was two weeks ago. Cool, whole time. And sure, we need we need another one for little Barry over here. No? Alright. Barry, the leaf, the single leaf blue must go his own way. Did we already name one Barry? I feel like we called another blue Barry just because it was B. In the Pikmin universe, do humans become Pikmin? Yep. You end up pick bad ending of Pikmin 1. It becomes an Ollie Min. Beautiful. I'm actually really enjoying the Wii version of this game. Because I know I really didn't enjoy the Wii version of the first game. When it first when it first came out, or when I first I don't even know what it was. Was it I I don't remember the full context of whether I played it or whether like I was watching someone else play it. Probably a bit of both. I probably did both now that I think about it. But I, I can't tell you for complete accuracy. And the main reason I didn't like it was because of the sound effect of the bulb orbs. But then I also heard that's a regional thing. So I don't know. I do have the Wii version of Pikmin now. I got it for Christmas, actually. Did I mention that already? No, yes I did. Um, so that'll be fun to play with. You are Cupid's Grenade. Everyone remembers you. You are uh, Crystallized Clairvoyance, perhaps? I think we've already had Clairvoyance. Dissonance. Resonance. I don't actually remember what the other Clairvoy- uh, Tele- No. Uh, crystallized stuff is, but that doesn't matter too much. But yeah, no. So, uh, I imagine in the future we will do a Super Chat version of Pikmin 1. Just because, hey, everyone loves Pikmin. Well, and me too. So why not find another excuse to play it again? Cupid's Grenade. I remember this because I made a whole joke around it. No Barry, Barry, but we did have Terry. Barry. Oh, Meep's here. Hi, Meep. Another regular. Hello. Thanks for coming to us. Oh, telepathy. Oh, of course. I was thinking telekinesis. Because we had telekinesis last time, I figured it was already taken. I forgot. Two words sound the same. Right. Can we do this without dying as well? Is that an option?
Beautiful. Two whites took it down. Oh, there it is. Yep. I was like, something falls on us here, doesn't it? I was right. Oh, dude. Why did I whistle from him? That was a bad move. Oh, Lord. Horseshoe. Shoe. Horn. Curve. The magnetized magnet. I don't think it actually calls it a magnet. Man, I'm not sure of this one. Oops. But I also I'm keeping myself the crystallized telepathy I'm keeping because I said crystallized. What is Super Chat? Uh, if you put in Exomars Challenge, you will see it. Basically, if you... Uh, heavy Duty Magnetizer. I did say magnet, so I'm going to go with that one, right? So, basically, if you put in a, uh, a donation of any sort, you can add an extra challenge to the rule. The current one we have going on is if I get a name of an enemy or a treasure wrong, I have to sacrifice a Pikmin. Pretty basic. Uh, we did one two weeks ago, which was the last time I streamed, pretty much. Um, where we had to do things like play using your feet, play with the controls reversed, um, fight the water wraith without looking at the water wraith, zoom in all the way, get every treasure in the submerged castle, fun things like that. So basically, uh, bits seem to be the easiest way to do it on Twitch. You put in a little, throw a bit my way and then you can, uh, make things, make my, my life hard, basically, is the, is the kind of goal here. Give me a challenge, since I played Pikmin 2 so many times that I could probably do it blind. So, uh, why not give me the, the, the platform to actually make me do it blind? I'm not going to do it blind, though, actually. That's a rule I probably can't stomach. And also, I have nothing to blind me. Damn it, I thought I could just swarm him. Ooh. You're just whistle, aren't you? The big whistle. The whistle-eyed whistler, sir. I don't remember it being any much else. Ooh, hello. Is it dwarf orange bulb or orange dwarf bulb? Like, what does it define first? Dwarf or orange? Oh, well. It's the emperor whistle. I'll take it. I feel like it's Dwarf Orange Bob Orb. Oh, we're all here. Okay. Never mind. Come over this way, please. Oh, and now they don't split into two groups. Some interesting AI around here. I've got to admit. Damn it, I almost had it the aim right. It just the controller's gone all the way to the right. For some reason. It's not a Wii thing, it's literally me and my setup. I'm too close to the screen. Because I'm not playing on a TV, I'm playing on a computer monitor, so I'm really close up. Oh well. Right, what's next? They don't throw a ball ball at us here, do they? That's way later, right? No, no, I, 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 I get a feeling it is here. I get a bad feeling about everything. But I need a Pikmin for it. Controller, please, I'm swinging around in all sorts of directions. I'm even leaning back for you and everything, and nope. Dude, really? Are you just the treasure? Seriously? Thought of something way more dev devastating. Never mind. All right. Crystallized clairvoyance. It is crystallized te telepathy, telekinesis, levitation. I don't actually know what else they do. It's just psychic stuff, isn't it? 
telecalized, telecalized, uh, crystallized crystallization. I don't know. Crystallized clairvoyance. I knew it was there eventually. I wasn't sure if we already had it last stream. Or just anywhere. No, I guess we do. This is the only place we... No, we've seen crystallized stuff in the past. Do excuse me. You're the only person that wants to see a Super Smash Brothers game that is like Hyrule Warriors? That would be quite cool, actually. I did play through all of um, Hyrule Warriors in my own time. But I had a bad habit of just daydreaming as I played. It was very sort of, you could turn your brain off as you played. It was just kind of the format of the gameplay. But yeah, I guess. Oh, right. The gamepad is falling over behind me. There we go. Oh. Oh, I was like, oh, uh, Louis talking very loudly in my ear. It's because I accidentally turned the volume up for myself. There we go. Stop talking to me, Louis. I'm so glad I found that, by the way. It's like, yes, he is saying Oloma. Even in the name of the audio, I think it literally says Olimar, but what do I know? Uh, we need more yellows, I would guess. The yellows, the uh, the blues have had their fun. They're not needed as much now the Submerged Castle is done. Well, I guess they're kind of needed for shower room, but hey, it doesn't matter. Thank you. No, it looks like I would have needed more blues, because there's water everywhere here. Alrighty then. Actually, let me prepare for swarming this time, shall I? Not this time. Man, we still have over 70. I'm impressed with myself. Here we go. Okay, yes, yeah, so they do get on the head, but it's not a ton. Well, still doing a lot of damage this round, so what do I know? Yeah. Alright. Single round, no death. Snag it run. I think it's the best I ever do. Sweet. No, we don't need... Well... Alright, yes, I guess we do need the blue one. The Lapis Lazuli. Uh, candy Pop Bud, that's it. Lapis Bud? Lapis Candy Pop Bud? It doesn't matter to me. Oh, they definitely got that, like, bug sound good. And the way it rumbles around. Hello again! Oh, lovely meeting you here. Ugh, the bing. Oh, oh, it's horrid. Come on. Thank you. Not fun. Alright, I guess we'll just turn our newly grown yellows into blues. Okay. I imagine Barry is still with us, but uh, he's going to get lost in the crowd. I don't know what that shish kebab is called. It's really bothering me. So I'm not going to collect it yet to give me time to think on it. <sighs> okay. Okay. There we go. Just do it like that. Hey, look, they even went to the, right, the closest spot for us. Convenience. Ah. Oh. Not so convenient. 
Oh, hello, Red. Didn't know you were over here. Okay. Not this time, buddy. I'm doing it the safe way. Because i got to actually be kind of careful. I don't have an endless population like I usually do in my playthroughs. Oh, damn it. You too? A leaf, luck, wafer, glorified death, dumb Pikmin physics and realities. Come on. There was also a rule last uh, last stream that if a Pikmin was in danger, you could only whistle once. That was a fun time for everyone involved. So, Leaf Luck Leviathan thing. Green. See you in five hours, Gemarat. Go to sleep. Enjoy it. Science project. I did not know. Sorry, buddy. Man, this cave is just not for yellows, is it? Uh, meat. Satchit. Satchul. Shish kebab stick combination ice cream lid <laughs> I don't know what this is fun plastic porcelain I don't know what the lid is triple sugar threat no I didn't know that one lid Joy, leisure, leisure, cyan, blue, ocean. Not gonna get this one. Saliva tricks. I faintly remember that, but not. Don't really associate it with the design. Just remember it base as a basic name that exists somewhere in the game. All right. I guess we're not done here. That's fun. No, it's not you. Oh, we got another Snagret to defeat? Oh, it's just you. It is literally just you. Okay. Oh, you're the segmented Crawbster's missing claw. Um, it's just like, it's just like claw, isn't it? Meaty hook? Uh, nope, I'm thinking of SpongeBob there. Um, a crustacean. I have no clue. Oh, Meep, you missed the last, most of the last stream because you were sick. Well, thanks for joining this one. Hopefully you're feeling less sick now. Mysterious remains. Damn it, I did know that. And that is supposed to, I think it's supposed to be foreshadowing for the segmented Crawbster. How exactly it went from the uh, forest of... The Awakening Woods even all the way over to the uh, Wistful Wilds. I have no idea, but that's the thing. It's good to hear you getting better, Meep. Oh boy! If you've got any good ideas for a rule, now would be a time for it. I hope the delay isn't enough that I would have already defeated the boss by then, but I feel like I'm not going to be that quick. What do I know, though? Oh, of course. The one time. Purple. I need the one purple. There we go. Good job, purple. Can you do it again? No, nope, because they're gone. Ah, 
How did you already activate? Dude, what happened? We didn't do anything. Alright, well, great. We got the Barring Snagrets. And we got the... Snarrow. Is it called a Barring Snarrow? Is it even called a Snarrow? Am I thinking of something else? The Footed Snagret. Okay, so yeah, we are missing one and it's just gotten in the middle of the battlefield. Is that what I'm seeing here? No, I have no idea what I'm seeing here. Come on, bully it! Yes! Okay, cool. We're doing good. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, I thought you were giving me another, another stuck dive one. All right, good. My whole camera just sort of glitched. Well, like, my, my controller gave me a little itch. Oh, are you serious? You're sticking around again? No, you're not. Gosh, this does feel a bit more Pikmin 3 now. I'm liking it. Oh, that's horrifying. Just the sound of the wind they put on his hops. Oh, yeah, that's very horrifying. All right, let's go here instead. Going to go charge ourselves up a bit. A bit more. Thank you. Where's our missing guy still? I still haven't found him yet. Okay, you're, wow, that was some quick gut diving you got over there. Stop hopping, please. My fringe is getting in the way of the screen. I can't see. I need a haircut. Oh. Hello. Didn't even know you were there. Have you gone in yet? No, you haven't. Go in. Thank you. Man, you really do have, like, domain over this whole area, don't you? Oh, look, there's Barry. Our last guy. Our last leafy blue. No longer is he remembered or notified as leafy Barry. Oh, perfect. I think doing my best here, all right? I'm doing what I can. All right. So maybe I shouldn't... Well, I should swarm because it saves my Pikmin. But at the same time, it's like I don't get a lot of damage in because he goes away immediately every time it happens. Ah. I guess that's how they designed him, to be a little harder than the Snagrits in that sense. Burgeoning? No, that's Burgeoning spider warp. Um, that's, uh, that's the Caterpillar guys, I think. I'm thinking of. Nope, spider warp is the spider thing. The thing that covers the potion area. Oh well, never mind. Don't mind me getting the enemy's name wrong, meaning we're going to need sacrifices that we already had plenty, so maybe not. There we go, okay. So maybe that's how I'm going to have to do it. Not quite sure how we missed, honestly, but alright. Oh man, I remember last time I played him, I froze him while he was like in mid-air. It was awesome. I enjoyed that. Alright, buddy, come on. He's just got too much HP. I'm not doing any damage. Oh, I got an idea that might help. I don't know why I haven't been using these, honestly. Just I've always been quite cautious with them. What does a what does a, a glorified Pikmin like this taste like? You gotta wonder these things, you know. I guess spicy would be the obvious answer. Ooh, bad choice, buddy. You're not a Scorch Guard, because that's not what they call you. But I don't know. And I don't think I can sacrifice any Pikmin for the guy's name anyway. Um... Guards, 
blue, blown away, eaten, the gnaw resistor. G-N-A-W. Well, it just resists you from being gnawed. It doesn't, it's not called a gnawinator. Justice alloy, I faintly remember that, but not really. All right, I guess we are still sacrificing whatever we got. Where is that last Pikmin? What are you doing? Oh, you're over here. Just hiding away. Probably the guy that even activated it as well. All right, so I guess we're doing a reversal of a sacrifice. We're gaining Pikmin afterwards. I think we need more blues after all this. All right, no we don't. All right, people, this was the Snagrit Hole. Where are we going next? What do people want to see next? We, aren't, we can't do anything in the Wistful Wilds, because well, by the time we unlock the Wistful Wilds, we'll be done with the stream, imagine. But uh, what do people want to see? Where are we going next? Hey, Bagman.